If only I could finish something Run straight through to the end Close a chapter dignified Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel and thank you guys so much for joining me for today's decorating video. Finally, I'm so excited to share with you guys how I decorated for winter going into spring. It is definitely the coldest month here where I live, but I was still craving something a little bit more spring-like. However, I don't know, I'm just a jumbled mess. I wanted something a little bit neutral, but moody, kind of like fall. And still, I wanted to make it work for winter, but also make it work for spring. I don't know, but what I do know is I absolutely love how everything turned out. I hope you guys do too, and I hope it brings you some decorating inspiration. As you guys know, there will be a part two, which will be decorating the coffee bar, dining room, and kitchen area, but I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Without further ado, let's go ahead and get started. Please don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if you enjoy it, and don't forget to subscribe if you are new. And yeah, let's go ahead and start. Okay friends, we are starting off by placing the new lamp I got from the hearth and hand line over in my entryway table. I absolutely love this lamp. I think it looks so good. Like I said in my haul video, if you guys haven't watched, I will link it down below. But I just feel like it looks a little bit more vintage and I just love that dark green shade that the shade is and then the gold base as well. On the other side of my entryway table, I'm just adding this black vase. Again, I'm just incorporating a lot of dark, moody colors. But I thought these stems from, again, the Hearth and Hand line at Target were perfect. I'm honestly quite disappointed with a lot of the Hobby Lobby stems. And these were only $6 a piece, which I think is really good for the size they are and how realistic they look as well. So I'm just putting four of these stems in this vase. Run straight through to the end Close the chapter dignified Dang girl you did it again But will it ever be enough When I'm bent on trying to keep it tough Will I ever settle down Okay friends, and real quick, if you guys are hearing my baby cooing in the background, it is because I am trying to find little crevices of time to do these type of things. And right now, it's his playtime, so that is why. But nonetheless, as you guys saw, I went ahead and added the decorative boxes from the Studio McGee line. I love these boxes. I think the color is perfect and exactly what I was going for. And also the candle I just added over in the corner of the table. I love it. It just looks like such a pretty decorative piece. And I'm just adding back this gold tray with the matches and the like candle accessories that I've had on here for fall, Christmas, and now winter. I just love this little setup and I honestly do use it a lot when I'm lighting my candles so it is just perfect And lastly, I'm just adding this candle holder with some candles and this cute little container that is from the Studio McGee line last year during their fall collection. 
Now for the little table on the side of my couch. This is where I moved this huge big lamp. This is from the Studio McGee line. I'm realizing I have a lot of Target decor, <laughs> but I just love it so much. Again, this is the olive green base and I just think it's such a beautiful lamp. I'm actually kind of happy that I found this configuration because the glass lamp I had in my living room previously is going into my master bedroom. So I absolutely love it here. I'm just adding this little picture frame, some coasters and a candle. I got several, several months ago. so proud of myself for really just reusing a lot of the pillows that I already have. I just brought this floral one back out. It is a pillow cover from Amazon and paired with these two that I had out for Christmas. I think it just gives it such a new look and again those moody colors are absolutely perfect. This blanket I just laid on the couch is actually my baby's favorite so we use it with him every single day and this is a new addition and I absolutely we love it I've been wanting to buy a runner for this area for so long and I just hadn't done it but I finally got this one from Target and I love how it looks here I think it really does set the entryway area versus like the living room area and again those moody colors those dark rich browns I think work perfectly for what I was going for Now I'm just adding this beautiful brown blanket to this corner of the couch. I really wanted it to hang over the couch so you can see it as you're walking through the entryway. I just love the combination of colors. It looks so pretty, you guys will see at the end. But now I'm just gonna go ahead and add my pillows. As you guys know, this is the only new pillow I bought for the season. It is from Target. I love the plaid design and the colors on it. And then this one, again, I've had for several years, but it is from a Target. And this last one I got for the fall season from the Studio McGee line. And again, I used it for fall, for Christmas, and I'm using it once again for winter. And now for the other corner of my couch, I did purchase the green pillow cover from Amazon. It was like $8 and it's such a good quality pillowcase. I absolutely love it. And the other pillow I already had. So just putting those on this corner and I just love the combination of all my pillows. Now for my coffee table, I wanted to keep it simple. This is a storage, so it needs to be easy to move, especially now that we have our baby. We just need to access our storage here more easy. So I'm just using these two coffee table books, this bowl, and inside of it, I'm just going to add this greenery filler. And I just love it. It's such a simple setup, but it looks so good. Okay friends, another new purchase is this tree from the Hearth and Hand line. I know it seems like I've purchased so much new decor, but to be quite honest with you guys, I got rid of a lot of my decor as we were preparing for our baby, and I just loved a lot of it that just recently came out, and I had held off on buying decor for a few months again as we prepared for babies. So after the holidays, I had some gift cards and some cash that I was gifted 
did and I just decided to spend it on what I love which is decor so I just put that little tree over in my wickered umbrella basket and then on this side of my mantle I'm adding a clock and this like diffuser it smells amazing these candle holders to match the ones I have on my entryway table and then just this little vase with some baby's breath of course I have some art on our frame TV and that is it I absolutely love how everything came out I will show you guys all the clips Alrighty everyone, well that is everything for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it and like I said, I hope it brought you some decorating inspiration. I really do love how it turned out. Again, just after having my baby boy, I was just craving something a little bit simple, neutral, but cozy for this winter month and I really love how everything turned out. I hope you guys did as well. As always, if you guys enjoyed this video, please give me a thumbs up and please don't forget to subscribe and I will see you guys in my next one.